You have a cell phone, computer probably. Mm -hmm. Well, you're ready to tweet. Tweeting. Do you know what that means? <laughs> <laughs> Natasha Ryan is with us. Give us a lesson. You know, I have to confess, I, I don't know what that means. I don't and, and that means I'm out of the loop, I guess. Clearly, you are not hip in the social media <laughs> world. But no worries, neither was I about two months ago. It's all about instant information. Hopefully, this helps you. When you hear the term tweet, it's not a nickname for Tweety Bird, and no, it's not the sound the cartoon character makes. It has to do with Twitter, a very popular way to connect with people. In 140 characters, you tell what you're doing. Put a tweet out there. It's real time. People find out about it immediately. Twitter is a social media network that's taken flight. You set up a short profile on the Twitter website. In one click, you can send a message to hundreds, even thousands, from a computer, your cell phone, or your wireless device. That's called tweeting. Uh, if I have 400 followers and I tweet something, say, right here about this interview, uh, before this hits the news media, ev everybody that is my friend on Twitter knows that we are doing a, an interview with you. Without having to log into any website, the tweets go directly to your phone or email. You might remember when Virginia Tech coach Frank Beamer decided to remove quarterback Tyrod Taylor's red shirt. Everyone on Twitter knew instantly because someone was tweeting as that news conference was going on. You're going to like this house. This Twitter can also do a lot for business. Just ask New River Valley realtor Jeremy Hart. Tweeting has given him more foot traffic. Every time I, I post something on Twitter or every time I write a blog post, I'm interviewing for my next client. I'm interviewing for that next buyer or seller. That's a huge reason why I've drank the Kool-Aid. I mean, I'm a, I'm a huge believer in all of these things because um, it works. Believer indeed. As we were shooting this interview, we couldn't help but notice Hart typing away on his BlackBerry. So you're actually tweeting right now? As we speak. Got to let everybody know. What are you letting them know? <laughs> Doing an interview with Natasha Ryan from WDBJ7. <laughs> okay, so we're going to do a little experiment here. Okay. I'm Good. going to send a tweet, and it's going to say, who's watching right now? And we'll show you the responses oh, at 11. Okay. I probably would get some in the next 30 seconds, but you guys have to move on and leave me behind. It so doesn't get okay. more real time than that. No, uh-uh. That's very cool. Done. <laughs> and then you said it kind of compounds and snowball effects so, right. so many so people. Right, so if someone sees that, they'll tweet it to other people, and retweet and, and tweet going. and tweet, and what can you do? And, and as you say, we've got to move along. Yes. But um, you can uh, check out Twitter yourself, Yeah. you know, will. if you want to. We posted a link on our website. Just log on to WDBJ7.com, click on Web Links.